A few years ago, I did an internship at a church, and towards the end of that time, a very wise and godly man gave me a little bit of advice. He suggested to me uh, that I, I wasn't yet the leader that I could be. And the reason was, he said, um, I was a bit like an archer who was a fairly good shot, but only had one arrow in my quiver. I had just one way of doing things that would work for me. And that one way might work in certain situations, but it wouldn't work all the time. Over the years since then, I've realized that he was right. I've learned that to do what I want to do in ministry and in church planting, that there's a lot of arrows that I need to have. I've tried to add more arrows to my quiver over that time. And actually, it reminds me of something that the Apostle Paul seemed to be feeling in Corinthians. He said, I'll be all things to all people, that by all means, some might be saved. Okay? He, he wanted to use any method he could. He wanted different arrows in his quiver. We dream of seeing a thousand new churches planted in a generation. To see that happen, we need people who can go out there with many arrows in their quiver, many different ways of doing things. Because if we go with just one or two ways, it may work, but it may not. So I want to challenge you with the same thing that my friend challenged me those years ago. How full is your quiver? How many arrows do you have? And what arrows do you need to add to your quiver to fulfill the ministry that God's given to you?